Hi everyone, I'm Jordan, a Tiny House Consultant here at Mint Tiny House Company. Let me walk you through my favorite canopy use edition. So you walk right into the living area space. Perfect space for an L-shaped couch. You can have your TV right across from you. My favorite part is the French doors and the amount of windows in this space makes it feel super open um, and cozy at the same time. So when you walk into the kitchen space, you immediately see the eating bar. It's perfect for two people. You can also squeeze in three. Um, but here obviously would be a great extra space too for baking, cooking, even crafts. Uh, especially for families. Um, but also my favorite part about this kitchen is the amount of storage that's in here. So in this kitchen, you have 10 feet high ceilings and you have windows around you. So despite it being an RV, it does feel super, super open. And this kitchen is designed in a way that if you live with more than one person, you can work and not get in each other's way. So someone could be here cooking, and someone could be here washing the dishes and you won't be too close together. And if you do place a custom order, you could opt to have a dishwasher instead of this door cabinet, um, especially for families or people who are working on super busy schedules. It's obviously a house essential. After your kitchen, you go right into the bathroom and immediately on your right is where the laundry connections are. So all the plumbing, electrical and ventilation is provided and you can have us install the laundry as well if you'd like. And then on your left is your vanity space where you can install a mirror or a medicine cabinet. Uh, you have your toilet, which you can have us install a composting toilet if you do prefer. Um, and then you have your large vinyl shower, which has frame glass doors. Uh, with black hardware matching the rest of the house. And that brings us into our bedroom. In the gooseneck area is where you can fit a queen size mattress. And my favorite part about this is the closet space. Here you have Jack and Jill closet. So this side could be his, this side could be hers, but if it's my house, both sides are mine. So a lot of people also don't know this but there is hidden storage beneath the gooseneck area because this is where the propane heater is typically installed. We want to make sure it's accessible to you if you ever need to access it, which also comes with a bonus of extra storage. Um, if you have any seasonal jackets that you want to put away or outdoor gear, um, then it's amazing. So on this side is where the exterior storage hatch is in below the gooseneck. Uh, which is another place for you to put outdoor gear, bins, extra storage for anything at all. So when you leave the gooseneck bedroom, when you go down these stairs, you can also use this as extra storage. So perfect for towels, toilet paper, and all things like that. When you leave the bathroom, right above you is the second loft, which acts as storage or extra sleeping space. So on the other side, you have a storage staircase, which is super comfortable going up. And then it leads us right into the main loft. So in here, the ceiling is about four feet high and the size is three feet high. Now I'm five foot two for reference. Um, you can fit a queen size bed in here, but I've also seen owners use it as office space, play space, kids bedroom, uh, main sleeping space if they wanna work in their gooseneck bedroom for working remotely. There's so many purposes, more than just storage. Thanks for joining me on this tiny house walkthrough of the Canada Goose Edition, the Arctic layout. If you wanna see all of our layouts and our models, you can go to our website in the description. And if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact us directly. We're more than happy to help you find what works perfectly for you. If you like this video and you wanna see more, check out our last video here. Don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell. We'll see you next time.